All right, hey you guys. So before I start my haul video, as you guys can see, here's a little sneak peek. I will go ahead and cover it, most of it, so you guys don't know what everything is. Um, but I am going to put a disclaimer here because I have to disclaim that not everything in this video you will have in your store. I'm going to put a disclaimer before every haul so you guys know that um, every store is different. Every state, city, is all different. I went to two different little cities and um, you know each one held something else and some places actually didn't even have any Christmas. They were still fully loaded with Halloween. So if you guys see something that you like and you don't have any target just wait. It's still too early for Christmas. I don't care. I got no shame in my game. I will show you what I got for Christmas. If you're saying it's too early, I'm sorry. I apologize. X out of the video right now because this is all Christmas. And like, um, you know, I have people like staring at me shop for Christmas stuff, but I don't care. Like Christmas is my favorite holiday. Halloween's not much to me and I have not forgotten about Thanksgiving. I'm just getting ready for the holidays, the most busiest time of the year. So anyways, here is what I got and let's go ahead and get moving to the haul video. Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. It's Brie from With Love Brie and today I have another haul and it's a bunch of Christmas stuff you guys. It's all Christmas this time. Like I know my last one was kind of like a mixture of everything but this one is... And you guys are probably wondering how Maui can get on here. Um... Well, let's just let him stay here, but anyways, okay, I'm gonna let him stay here for now, but he won't leave me alone. Like I said in my video when I showed you guys him when I, he was a puppy, um, he always followed me, and he still does, um, but yeah, like I said, I have Christmas stuff from the Dollar Tree, from Michael's, and Tuesday morning as well as the Target One Spot, you guys. It is finally here. It is happening. The Target One Spot now has holiday stuff. I am missing out on a lot of stuff. I already know. I've seen things that... Okay. I have seen things that um, have been out already, and my Targets actually don't have them. I have been to five different Targets today. Today was my day off from my two jobs, and... You guys, I went to five different targets while Brian was at school and taking a nap. <laughs> I took advantage and um, went some and did some shopping. So my Dollar Tree and Tuesday morning haul are a little bit older, but um, they're still Christmas stuff. And I've done this with Maui when he was a baby, but look how huge he is now. He's not a baby anymore. Say hi. My other dog is outside, but he follows me everywhere. So I'm going to try to get him down. Um, and you guys, like I said earlier, you guys are probably wondering, how is he on your mat like this? He is on my bed, actually. Um, I don't have a desk at the moment. It is covered up with a lot of stuff because I recently um, picked up a cube unit. And so I'm trying to organize that. Um, and that is taking me some time. Um, I've been way too tired lately to do anything. So I don't have a desk to record on, so I'm on my bed. I have my light set up. I have my tripod set up to where I can record on my bed. So I'm going to take him off. All right, so I'm going to get started with the haul now that I've done some talking. And he got my mat so wet. Oh my gosh, I have my sweater. You guys don't get grossed out. It's my dog. I'm going to wash this anyways. I'm just using my sweater. Okay, so let me go ahead and get started with Dollar Tree. All right, so the first thing that I picked up were some gift box, um, like jewelry gift boxes. So I got um, five of these. And I want to go ahead and um, use some of these to store some gifts in. And so I picked five of them. You get three for a dollar, and I thought that that was a really good deal. So I did go ahead and grab five of those. And there were some different colors, like metallic red, silver, blue. But I went ahead and grabbed the white because white you can always alter and do some different things to. So I went ahead and grabbed the white. 
Mom out, you can't be on camera. You're just way too big for this. You gotta stay there. Okay, stay. Good boy. Okay, stay there. And then I have um, got some of these straws. I might exchange it because I think I own a lot of these red and white straws, but we'll see. Um, so I did pick up a pack of this and you get 24 for a dollar. I grabbed two packs of sequins and this pink and purple mix and this blue and green um, like ocean type of mix. And I actually grabbed these for a pen pal um, because she says she likes sequins. So I did grab um, one of each pack of these because these are around the same colors that she likes. And I grabbed some of this lace for some Christmas um, crafts. And I don't know if you guys can see it. Looks like that's in a like off-white cream color. My gosh, Maui doesn't know how to stay. He wants attention. Sorry about that. So I got some of that lace. You get three yards for a dollar. Not bad. And then I also picked up this holographic pineapple mini album, or not mini album, sorry, photo album. And I went ahead and picked it up for a pen pal of mine. And I think I'm going to fill it with goodies before I actually give it to her. And then what she can do is she can go ahead and um, use it for like whatever she wants to. Um, but I am making some like tropical theme mail, so I thought this was perfect. And then for some Christmas crafting, I grabbed a bag of these. Um, there was only one bag. Um, I picked up a pack of these because I randomly saw it while I was walking down the party aisle. And I thought it'd be fun to work with um, some of the traditional colors that I've picked up. And so I did get a bag of those. You get um, 10 for a dollar. And then last but not least, from the Christmas section, they have those DIY ornament balls. But this year, I found these cute ornament mason jars. Look how cute this is. You can definitely spray paint the cover because it's just in this silver color. But look at how cute this is. And this is like a really good size to mail your um, to your pen pal. So... My Dollar Tree only had four, so I just picked up what they had, um, and I'm going to go ahead and just kind of, I'm not going to make like a little ornament, but what I'm going to do is fill it with goodies, and then my pen pal can probably, like, I'll probably alter them, and then they can do whatever they want to the inside. But I thought these were super cute, I've never seen these before, and for a dollar that's totally worth it. So I did grab four of those, and that was it from Dollar Tree. So I'm going to go ahead and clear this out. Okay, so next I'm going to show you from Tuesday morning. So I picked up some of this trendsetter um, polar bear like fiber. And this is how they store it. I don't know if all of your guys' Tuesday mornings um, store their ribbons and stuff in Ziplocs. But that's how mine does. And it is like kind of like eyelash trim, but it's in a polar bear, like our teddy bear, um, like texture, I guess. <laughs> now he's like peeking through. He's like, whoa, it matches my fur. Um, but yeah, so I thought these would be fun for some winter crafts because, you know, winter, like the little um, animals and stuff, thought this would be fun. This was $6, and to be honest, I think this is really cute. So I said, F it, I'm just going to get it. So that's what I got there. No, do not grab it. He loves, he's like a cat. He loves yarn. Um, and then I picked up this little bee washi tape with a gold polka dot and gold um, pineapple. And it was $1.99, and I picked this up for a pen pal. Same pen pal that I was talking about earlier. And then from the Christmas stuff, I picked up this um, Twinkle Dimensional Stars in red. How oh, did I red? Gold and silver. And there is a red and green color scheme as well, but I just picked these up for $1.99. 
And then I found these hiding. These are $2.99 each and they are these mini tote bags and I thought these would be fun to alter and gift to some pen pals. Um, and you get six in a bat or a pack. So I thought that was a really good deal. And I was going to get two of them, but I think one is good enough. I found these um, chipboard candy canes and look how large these are. They're super large and they um, were $1.99 each. And they're just so pretty and bright, so I thought these would be fun to include in some Happy Mail as just some extra goodies. And then for $1.49, I found these Pebbles printed tags. And again, they were $1.49, and they come with these designs here. And then last but not least, I know this is like the smallest haul. I went to two different Tuesday mornings for all of this. Um, my Tuesday mornings haven't been holding very many Christmas stuff, so um, I didn't really get too much. But I did pick up this 12 by 12 It's called Holly Jolly. And I don't know, I might return it. Maybe not because it is kind of far for me. Because I feel like for $6.99 I can get another paper pad that I really want. Um... But I really like the colors, and because I picked up these tags, I feel like they really go together. But I can go ahead and flip through this for you really fast. So you get some 3x4 cards like usual. Look how cute this little jammy and cookie um, uh, onesie pattern paper is. It's so cute and very Christmassy. Like... I don't know. This is like one of the reasons why I picked it up because the patterns are so cute. Um, and I really love this like deer print. So I might keep it. I'm pretty sure I will. But I am, like I said, I got a cube unit. And so I am realizing how much paper I have because I really wanted a cube unit to store my 12 by 12 papers. And I just realized how many 12 by 12 paper pads for Christmas I have that I haven't used. So, yeah, that's how that looks. And that, again, that is called Holly Jolly. Super pretty paper pad. So that is that. And then that was all from Tuesday morning. Okay, so for those of you that don't have me on Instagram, I recently posted a picture of, or put on my story, a picture of me in my uniform for my second job. And my second job now is Michael's, so I recently got hired and um, I am super excited to work there because I've been wanting to work there for so long. And it's I realize how dangerous, dangerous it is because I know I get a discount, but I also know that what we have... Um, and, you know, all the Christmas stuff is not on sale yet, so even though I have a discount, it's still not really, like, you know, really saving because, um, you know, um, my discount can go on top of sale items, and because the Christmas stuff is not on sale, I'm not really getting a bang for my buck. But I couldn't wait because this stuff I know will sell out, and I was kind of right because... The stuff that I got actually did sell out, even though they're not on sale. People are using coupons to get these things off, to get them for a discounted price. So I'm glad that I got them when I could. And so I'm going to go ahead and share with you here. So the first things that I picked up were these really cute mason jar shakers. These were $2.49, but with my discount I got them for like a dollar something. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Yeah, I got them for $1.74. And so I got two packs of those, and I don't own so very many stickers, but I see so many people with all these stickers, and I went ahead and picked some up. And I cannot wait to use these on some Happy Mail. No, you cannot have it. Stay here. And look how cute these are. So they shake, and then they have the little truck, or the little car with the um, tree on top. Super cute. So I got two packs of those. And then um, the stamp sets were 50% off, so I grabbed two of those, two different ones. I grabbed the clear stamps and dies, and they have little sentiments. I was going to pick up the Tim Holtz ones online, but because these were on sale and I get an extra discount, 
Um, I thought I'd go ahead and just pick these ones up instead because they do have um, some little sent sentiments. Um, they say joy, peace, Noel, believe, love, merry, and cheer. And I think those are enough. Um, and I like that they have the little matching die, um, die sets. So I got that. And these were 50% off and I got an additional discount. So for this I ended up paying just $5.24 from $14.99. And then I saw this Mama Elephant, um, what is this called? I think it's just a reindeer stamp set. But it comes with the dies. Again, it was $14.99, and I got it for $5 as well. And it comes with the cute little deer. <laughs> They're so cute. I love it. And then they have the matching dies, so I can even hand, um, die cut the little ornaments and stars. So I thought that was really fun. And even the tree, so... I got that for five dollars. Then um, I got a couple more items left, and I was super excited for these, and I cannot wait to show you guys because I think you guys will get excited too. Um, so Tim Holtz has the most amazing collection out right now at Michaels, and seriously, like I want to get some more stuff, but I just limited myself. <laughs> I guess you can say this: I limited myself. But these were the items that I started seeing. Um, selling down. So I got one of these wood slices. I've been meaning to get wood slices and they're just so hard and so expensive to find. But these are originally $7.99 and so I got a pack of those. And you get... Molly! Give this to me. No. Let go. Bad boy. No. Bad boy. Look what he got into. I'm telling you, you guys, he loves ribbon and string and all that. I gotta hide this. No. You crazy. Anyways, sorry. Um, but yeah, so I got a pack of those. Again, $7.99 original price, but just wait for it to go on sale. and You guys will get it for a better price. But I have been waiting for some wood slices, and so I went ahead and picked that up. Um, and then I picked up some paper pads well one paper pad and I got three of them and I think I'm gonna get a couple more because I think for my happy meal this is what I want to use so um here they are I'm just gonna set them here because I got three of them <laughs> here is the paper pad they are double-sided and here are the patterns they are so cute you guys so these are originally $12.99 I believe yeah they're originally $12.99 and I got them for $9. But again, like I said, even as an employee, um, if I waited for them to be on sale, I would have gotten them for a lot cheaper. But um, they are, people are buying them and they're using coupons on them. So I went ahead and just picked three of them up. Mm. I'm just going to try my best here to rip this. Alright, so I'll go ahead and flip through this. Like, look at this pattern. How can you say no to this flannel? The colors are so pretty. There's like a light blue, a navy, like midnight blue actually. A midnight blue and then this red. It's just so pretty. I really love flannel prints. So I got that. Or I got that. <laughs> it comes in here. And then there's this distressed snowflake. This typewriter print. It's a black and white. And another... Distressed flannel print. These little berries and leaves. And I love that it's on black. Let me get this distressed stripe. But I'm pretty sure I'm just going to use this side. I'm not too much of a fan of that side. But this side is super pretty. I guess I'm just dressed polka dot. Black and white flannel. And on my camera, it's showing up a little brighter. It's a little darker in person, but it's still really pretty. And then there's another typewriter print. It's a pretty floral piece. And these are like little crosses. And they're making little diamonds. I just love the distressing on here. Super cute, you guys. Look at this. Sweater print. It's 
so you get two of each, you get 24 papers, and so there's 12 designs. Loving the berry print, and then look at this cute plank paper. Cute little snowflake pattern, stars, and then this little cut apart for like some ephemera, vintage ephemera. But you do not have to worry about this if you don't want to. If you want to use that as a whole, you can because he came out with some matching die cuts because what is a set without die cuts? So I did grab this and there are 69 pieces, a very odd number to choose for anything. But um, yeah, so there's 69 pieces in here of some ephemera and this is from the Christmas Noel. And I grabbed three of these, um, one for each pack, I guess. And I think Maui is grabbing. Stop grabbing stuff! No, bad boy. Mind you, he's still a puppy. He looks huge, but he's still a puppy. <laughs> so here is that. So I got three of those. And then that is it from Michael's. But even with just these, I almost spent hundred dollars. <laughs> I almost spent a hundred dollars on all of this stuff and I probably could have saved and probably gotten double of this if I waited for them to go on sale. But uh, that is what is out for now that I've seen at Michael's, at least at my Michael's. So I'm super excited. There's actually a lot more but this is all I grabbed. So I'll leave these ones actually out for you guys to see. So that is from Michael's. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the Target one spot and you guys I think I, I did okay. I mean, there's a lot more that's missing, but I did pretty good, so. I went to five different, my, I mean, to five different targets, like I said. Five different targets. Alright, so, I'm going to show you this first so I can start throwing things in here. But every year during the holiday time, I like to pick up at least one of their bins. Um, because I have the cube unit, I wanted to go ahead and pick up some cute organizers to put some holiday stuff in because I want to make a spot for some holiday crafting items. And so I did pick up this gifting basket and it is $3 and it's in this flannel print. Of course, I had to pick it up. It's even in the flannel like um, fabric. And so um, it has this faux leather handle with gold um, eyelets or brads put into there and it even has a to and from if you're going to use it as a gift basket but I'm going to use it as some like an organizer and I was throwing everything in here um, so I think that's what I'm going to try to do here on this side just kind of throw everything inside of here but um yeah so or you know what no so you guys can see everything I'm not going to do that all right so here's from the first Michaels that I went to. Alright, so I picked up these felt stickers. And they are these cute little Santa faces. And they're layered with a bunch of different layers of felt. And that was a dollar. And then I picked up these cute felt snowflakes and snowman. Snowmen, I guess, because there's more than one. And they're just so cute. They are all the same. You get 15 in here. So I got a pack of those. And then I got a pack of these ones. And these ones have little gloves. Um, the snowmen, gingerbread men. Um, a star. Some ornaments, I believe. So there's some ornaments there. Um, you get the snowman, the gingerbread man, and then behind this there's a Christmas tree. And then you get a Christmas tree. So I got a pack of those and you get 15 in there. And then I grabbed two packs of these candy cane felt um, stickers. One has, uh, some have glitter and some are just matte. I don't know if you guys can see. But I got two packs of those, and each one you get 15 in there. And then I found these gifting tags. And they're for, like, mason jars. So if you're going to gift, like, homemade cookie mix or something, 
you can go ahead and do that. But these ones just say like season's greetings, um, happy holidays, making spirits bright. And they're clear with um, gold lettering and gold doodling. So I picked up a pack of those and these were a dollar. And then they had some like that said powdered sugar and all that stuff to label for your holiday baking stuff. So got that for a dollar. And then they have little box gift card holders, but of course I'm not going to use these for gift cards. I'm just going to use them to hold some goodies in. And I got a pack of those. And these were three for a dollar. Such a good price. And they're just super cute. So I got a pack of those. And then I found one of these candy cake, um, candy shaped gift boxes. I only found one of them. They look like this. So you get um, the Santa Claus, you get a polar bear, and then a penguin. And they're three for a dollar. And then you get, like, on the side, there are this these acetate, like, um, yeah, like candy ends, I guess you can say. So I got a pack of those, again, for a dollar. And a lot of these things, there was only one of each. So either someone's buying stuff already, too pretty sure they are um but yeah so I only saw a pack of those and a lot of people were complaining I know they always complain because I worked retail during the holiday time and they're always like oh my god like Halloween hasn't happened Thanksgiving hasn't happened but then when it Christmas does happen they're like oh my god Christmas came so fast I know it's just people complaining and stuff but you know they were looking at me like look getting all this Christmas stuff looking at me like I'm crazy but trust me you'll regret it you'll regret not getting these things um and so, yeah, and it was just funny because some people were complaining and they were just like, oh, like, already there's Christmas stuff? Like, Halloween hasn't even passed yet. Can't we just enjoy one holiday at a time? And I was just like, okay, well, I mean, you can. It's not like anybody's forcing you to <laughs> not enjoy Halloween. Um, and then next thing you know, they're looking at the cute little, um, like, ornaments that they were having in the, do the dollar spot and the candles. It's like, what the hell? Like, okay. But anyways, um, that's just me speaking my mind and what my thought was during that time. But anyways, I got these pillow box gift card holders and I got them because they're in that flannel, um, pattern. And I don't know if they're going to come out with pattern papers this year, but last year their pattern paper pads were super cute. I picked up a bunch of those, um, and these will match. So got a pack of those and you get three for a dollar. And a lot of the stuff I got was a dollar. Um, I think this is the only thing that was three. And then I got maybe one more thing that's three bucks. Um, and then they have some chunky glitter. So they have gold, they have red, they have gold stars. Um, they also have these iridescent like mini snowflakes and I don't have snowflakes this small. So I did grab two of these, and they were um, each a dollar. And they come in these cute vials that you can reuse. Because, you know, I use, um, I usually pour these into their own containers because they're a lot easier to pick up. So I might do that, just reuse them and make my own sequin mixes. Got two of those. And I might return these, I might not. I think I'll just keep them. They are... Um, the fabric bags um, every year they have different ones for different holidays and normally I don't pick them up but these ones are just so cute because they're flannel and so I did pick up a uh, three so they were a dollar each and they look like that and they're just super cute and I cannot wait to put some goodies in there and send to my pen pals so I got three of those and if I need more I can always grab them but I'm pretty sure I pro might, probably might not even use all of these. I always end up with extra at the end of the year or end of the season. So I think that's it um, for things that I don't have. Like, let me see. Yeah, okay. So the rest are like multiples of like, you know, the washi tape and stuff. So I want to show those together. Um, so let me go ahead and grab everything. All right, so 
This is not from the um, one spot, the Target one spot, but I did pick up some red crepe paper because I don't have red. And as you guys can tell, there's a lot in here. So I thought I'd go ahead and grab one to make some tags with or do whatever. So grab the pack of that. I grabbed these wooden shapes. They are gingerbread men. Look how cute they are. So um, you can paint them, you can color them with markers, um, acrylic paints, whatever. And um, I thought I'd go ahead and just use these as little wood veneers to give to my pen pals. And these were part of the kids um, section because they always have like a kids section and they have one for like adults and gifting. And so this is from the kids section. And this year they have like yellow and then all these colors as their color scheme. Got that. And then I picked up these felt shapes and I was kind of iffy about getting these but um, I do like the pink and the blue. Um, the only one I'm not too fond of is the purple and I think because like I said before I don't work with purple too much and I don't think um, any of my paper pads have purple but we'll see. Um, so I did grab a couple of those or no just one of them and they come with 10 so I guess that's a couple of felt candy canes um so yeah that's a dollar as well and then i grabbed another one of these last year in my um, target one spot haul i grabbed two of these for a dollar each or three dollars each actually and so again they have them for three dollars and i feel like they should never stop selling these because or ever stop selling these just because um these are really fun to make your own wreaths and for the price it's such a good price and i'm loving their labeling this year um we haven't gotten to the cute labels but yeah look at that it's so cute i love this so i got that for 2.98 i found this design your own planner and it does say you got this in gold, but what I'm going to do is cover that up with some patterned paper and probably use this as like a December daily. I did not do my December daily last year. I did do a process video of me doing the inside covers as well as the cover. Um, and I do have like layouts and stuff inside, but they are not complete. Um, so I only done one year and I've completed one year. But for this one, I think... I have an idea for this one. I think I'm just going to do like little layouts whenever I have time. Um, so that's why I don't mind how small it is. But it is a six pronged binder. So I am going to have to hang punch the holes. But that's that's cool with me. So that's how the inside looks. And then it comes with a little band to keep it closed. Super cute. So I got that on clearance. Alright, and then... Look at how cute these Christmas trees are. So glittery. So because I have a cube unit, I want to decorate my cube unit with some of these trees. And they have $3 ones, but for now I just picked up three of the $1 ones. And I got them in the different ombres that they have. These are the only three I've seen, so there might be more. I'm not sure. But I did grab them in three different ones. And I cannot wait to use these. They're just so cute. They're the little... um bottle brush trees and if they had a color scheme of like tags and like just all these crafting stuff with this color scheme I definitely buy every single thing from it because this color scheme is just so cute so I got those and they have the cute glitter and it's getting everywhere and it might be on my bed but I am sacrificing just to show you guys how cute these are so let's gonna put that put these here now I'm going to move on to the washi tape. Oh my god, you guys, this washi is everything. I am so lucky I went the day I went because I got a lot. So I didn't grab every single one. They had metallic green, metallic red, I believe a silver and a gold, and I didn't pick any of those up. They even had a glitter tree die cut one, but I just grabbed um, the ones I know I'm going to use. So... There's this Merry and Bright, and they have the, this bicycle with a cute little tree on top and a basket. And I don't know if you guys can see it. It just says Merry and Bright, and then it has the little bicycle. And you don't get too much product 
Okay, sorry about that. So I ran out of memory, so let's try to get this done really fast. But um, yeah, like I said, um, actually I don't remember what I was saying, but that is the tape that I got, and I got two of those. And they are so cute. And then I grabbed one of these gold scalloped ones. Super cute. Oh, I think I was talking about how much product you get in here. So you get um, three yards in each one. And I think they came with five yards before, maybe even more. But now they're coming with less, but that's fine. You can just, for the price you're paying for, three yards is still good. So I got that. And then I got two of these do not open until Christmas. And I think I have something similar to this by American Crafts. But I went ahead and grabbed two of these. They have this metallic red on there. And it just says do not open until Christmas. I hope you guys can see it, and I apologize for the glare. So I got those. And then I got two of these flannel ones. These match the little um, felt bags, or fabric bags, sorry. Just look at this. And you guys already know I had to grab three of these. They are the flannel print washi. I think I might grab one more. Because this one looks like it comes with a little bit. But a little goes a long way sometimes. So we'll see. But I barely own washi. Especially Christmas. So I thought I'd go ahead and just start owning a couple. And especially if they're cute. I'm going to grab them. So I got those. And then now I'm going to move on to some of the wooden stamps because there is a lot. So, there is from the kids stamp set this really cute fox. And I just love it because she has a cute little, um, I say little a lot, but she has a cute um, winter hat. And it's just so cute with her rosy cheeks. So I went ahead and grabbed that and this one was a dollar. And again, this one was from the kids um, section. And then, oh, and you guys see the packaging? It's so pretty with the wreath. Oh, I love it. And then, um, there are two different kinds of packaging for the stamps. I thought there was only one packaging, which was kind of similar to this, but there isn't. So they are also packaging them up like this so I got this to and from and it has this like rough outline I thought this would be super cute to stamp with some paint or um, regular stamping ink and put these on some projects or mail and then I got this one and it just says North Pole special delivery and to and from And then these ones here, so I seen these on Instagram and I had to grab them. Um, so I saw this Handmade with Love, and I don't know, I might return this depending if I have one from last year. I'm pretty sure I do. If I have something similar, I'm going to exchange it, but this one says Handmade with Love. Do not open until December 25th. And I love how distressed it looks. I thought this would look cute with the Tim Holtz stuff. And then these are the two stamp sets that I went to go look for. And I found it in my last Target. And it was actually the one next to my work. Um, and so I got this cute wreath. It's actually really large compared to these stamps. And for a dollar... You guys, all of these stamps are for a dollar, and the tape is also a dollar. And it's just so pretty. So I cannot wait to stamp with this and see how that looks. And this one, too, was just like, I need to get this. So there was only one of these. So I grabbed it, as well as the wreath, there was only one. So I grabbed them, 
and I cannot wait to stamp him. He's just so vintagey looking. He's not like that cutesy looking one. I love this one. So again, this was a dollar. And then that was it for the stamps. I am almost at the end, you guys. Um, again, I'm, I apologize for the long hauls, but I'm telling you, um, I like to show you guys, like, you know, everything in detail so you guys know exactly how they look and kind of get you guys excited for what to look out for. So, the last thing I'm going to show you are tags and um, wooden clips. So, first I'm going to show you the wooden clips. So, I got this one here. And this one just says, handmade for you, made with love, and made with Christmas love. And they are in the traditional red and green with some blue, like light blue. And this one has a different, like, wreath. It's super cute, though. And this one just has some blank, um, like, black trees. They're chalkboard clips. And normally I just keep them as is. Um, and then they have this really pretty, like, stained um, paper clip. It looks like a piece of wood. I don't know if you guys can see that. It looks super pretty. So I grabbed a pack of those. And these might go away quick, so I might grab another one. Because I like to clip these larger ones on my mail. And that was it for paper clips. There are so many, you guys, but I think I'm going to kind of make my own because I own a bunch of bare paper clips. Or I keep saying paper clips, but bare clothespins. And so I'm going to go ahead and kind of make my own version of the ones they sell. But um, I might grab one to show you guys. We'll see. It's only a dollar, so we'll see. But these here were a dollar each. And now for some tags. I'm so excited. I'm always excited for the holiday tags. So um, I picked up these. The, they're calling these wooden tags. Like, I don't know how they're tags. But they're just basically wooden stars. And they have string attached to them. And again, these are a dollar. And they're just these really cute stars. I had to grab them. So I got the, like, wood finish. And then I got them in the white. And again, it was a dollar. And then I found these wooden tags. And I like that they kind of show you how it would look like if you were to hang them on a tree. Yeah, so Target is definitely stepping it up. And their packaging is just so eye-catching, like, and so pretty and reusable. I feel like you could reuse the packaging. Um, but yeah, so these ones come with four wooden tags, and they each have different sentiments on them. Um, it says, believe, peace, merry, and joy. And they have a light, like, wood, a dark wood, and then two that have white, like, stain on it. And then it has red and white baker's twine. It's a dollar. Such a good deal. And each time I keep coming back, I kind of zoom out more because there's more stuff on the screen. So hopefully you guys can see more of the stuff. And then I got these wooden tags. And you get four. They're just some plain scallop wooden tags. And these would be fun to alter. And you get some jute twine in there, and this was a dollar. And now onto the larger pack tags. So I saw these on Instagram and instantly knew I had to grab these. They are Santa Claus um, tags. And he is resting on some wood grain and has a cotton ball on him. And it is a metallic red, if you guys can see that. He is so cute. So I grabbed two packs of these. And I think two packs should be enough. Since I have a stamp. I'm hoping you guys can see all this. And then, well I can see what you guys can see. But, I don't know. I'm kind of blind at the moment. <laughs> and then I grabbed these. These here have 
velvet um, texture on them. And they are just these little handmade gift tags. So um, made with Christmas love, handmade for you, handmade with love. And then you just get two of each pattern. And I know before they used to give like eight tags. Um, these ones have six. Six, yeah, I think six is the magic number this year. But look how cute these are. And then they have velvet. I don't know if you guys can see, but this has velvet. This red is velvet. Um, all the red is velvet. It's flocked, I guess you could say. Super cute. And last but not least from the Target One Spot, you guys. <sighs> if any of you see this in your Target and would love to sell them to me, I will buy them from you because I am so sad there was only one of these. And if they sell out before I can buy some more, I'm going to be sad. Um, they are these tags here. Look at how cute these tags are. And there's only six in here. I thought there was like two each one, but there isn't. And so there is some, um, each tag has treatment to it. So these ones here are like embossed. I don't know, it's like, it feels like snow, I guess. And then these ones are metallic red, foiled red. And then these ones here are glittered and like this really pretty champagne gold. You guys, if I can find like three, four, five more packs of these, I will definitely grab them because these are my all-time favorite tags at the moment. And I'm pretty sure this is going to be my most favorite buy from this whole collection this year. So each year, the Christmas stuff at Target gets better and better and better and better. And I am just so excited to work with these. Um, I just need a couple more paper pads. Um, like, I don't know if I need them, but... <laughs> I don't know. I, I've seen a couple that I want, so we'll see um, how that goes. But I'm just going to show you one last thing that I got from the kids' crafting section that I'm going to use for my Christmas stuff. Um, so I want to use this to organize my Christmas stuff. So this was $12.99, and it's like this, what is it called? A wood art caddy. And I want to stain it with some red, um, brown acrylic paint, see how I can do it with that. Because I was going to spray paint it gold, but I really love the wood, like, um, look. And so I want to use this and put it in my cube unit. But I don't know, it's not going to fit in my cube unit like this, so I'm going to have to put it long ways. But it's a lot easier of an access, so if I'm going to go to the kitchen or some not kitchen, but the living room and watch a movie, um, at least I can group get this caddy and then fill it with what I need and then use what's in here. So I'm super excited to use this. I don't know what I'm going to color it yet. I'm hoping just maybe brown. Um, that's what I'm shooting for. But this is what I um, had like my trees in. So I had like my stuff like organized in here. And I had them organized a little bit differently, but it was sitting in the car like, um, um, oh my gosh, I was, it was in the car and Brian saw it, I like lifted it up and he saw it and he was like, ooh, whoa, what is that? He was like, I'm not saying he got excited because he's probably going to watch this and he's going to be like, oh god, here she goes again with some story. But, um, yeah, so anyways, I don't know if he was excited, I'm not excited, but like, wow, like it looks nice, but it looks really cute like this. But it's not going to stay like this. But look at like how organized and stuff it looks. It's just so cute. So I cannot wait to use this. Um, this was something that I did not double think. Normally I double think organizers. But this one for some reason it just caught my attention. And I can see myself organizing all these cute things in here. So we will see how that goes. But. So that is my haul. Um. It's probably just going to get worse and worse, especially since I work at Michael's now. But I love working at Michael's. It is such a great environment because I know exactly what, like, not where, like, what everything is used for, but where everything is located. I mean, I still struggle, but I just love seeing all the art stuff and being able to work there. So, um, yeah, I did graduate from school, and yes, I'm having a hard time finding a job. So these jobs are temporary, um, but I 
Michael's is a really good place to work at, especially when your addiction is crafting. So anyways, I'm going to put a disclaimer. I think I'm going to go ahead and put a disclaimer in the beginning of the video. So you will see that in the beginning, but I'm going to say it again. Not every store has all these things. You guys have to be patient or if you're like, if you're patient and you still don't have it, some maybe your target isn't gonna have it and you could possibly find someone who can do a like you know self shopping kind of thing where you tell them what you want pay them for it pay the postage and then they can send some your way and so yeah um you know find ways to get what we have here and i don't know um i'm just letting y'all know now um and reminding you again that not every store has the same stuff and so you know maybe shop online i notice that they are now um putting target one spot stuff online so i think i'm going to do that for christmas and see what i can do there um to get these tags um now that i think about it so yeah that's basically it for my target one spot i say target one spot because i feel like this took over everything as well as my michael's one um but yeah so i hope you guys find everything and i will talk to you guys in my next video hopefully it's a christmas process video if not another haul all right you guys have a wonderful day and i'll talk to you guys later bye